how are you and welcome to another episode of the Borussia Dortmund Let's Save with me, John, aka Old Man Suda. And we've only had one game since the 2 1 defeat to Juventus in the Champions uh, League. We have qualified though, it looks like we're probably going to finish in second place in Champions League, but you never know, with one more game to go, we might, might win, win the group yet. Uh, we've played one game though, we've played against her, but we won 1 0, as you can see. We should have probably scored three or four more goals. But we're having a bit of a trouble scoring. Um, we're having the shots. Doing really well. But really with the amount of shots we're having. And even to be honest with eight on target. We should be putting more than one away. But overall can't really complain. We won, to, uh, we won the game. Um, competition wise it's still in third. We've got Red Bull Leipzig and uh, Bayern Munich in front of us. Um, Mainly on goal difference, obviously Bayern are uh, five points clear, but we're playing Bayern today, so we can ease that gap a little bit, which would be pretty good. As you can see here, we are one more game left in the Champions League, and then we are free. We've got Frankfurt in the next round of the German Cup, so everything's looking really positive. I've changed things up today, because we're playing Bayern Munich, I thought we'll try something a bit different. So this is the... Um, formation we're going to go with um, and the idea behind this is if we need to we can bring and we can take one of the forwards off and we can bring in fact actually I might do that anyway I think I think we're going to go with this uh, here I think just to try and make it a little bit better we'll have uh, Julian Way come in there and play him as a deep line playmaker Castro can play more as Deep line in support, and we've got a deep line playmaker in defence. We've got go to go as um the attacking playmaker, so I think that will do pretty well for us. Gives quite a bit of protection at the back, but we've a chance to push forward if need be. Uh, we'll change him into a poacher. Looking for obviously for Yamaloko and Sherla to bomb forward, get inside, and hopefully score some goals. And this is probably about the best week team we're going to be able to put out, I would imagine. Uh, maybe Bartra should go in of Topak. Uh, we'll do that as well, I think. And that's about it, really. There's not much else really to speak about. Like I said, there hasn't been too much um else happened news-wise or anything like that. So we'll get straight into the game. And you can see, buying our favourites, they're at home. Uh, we've been in decent form. They've been in excellent. Yeah, they are just slight favourites overall, I'd say. But you never know. We've always beaten them once this year in the uh, Super Cup. So there's a good chance we could beat them again, to be honest. So we'll see how we get on. Shouldn't be bad. Uh, I mean, they're playing four. They're playing quite... Uh, they've got quite a bit of a gap in the middle here, which hopefully Castro and Gotez maybe exploit a little bit for us team talk we're going to say passionately let's give these fans a good performance it seems to have gone quite well we'll do the usual passionate i think there's a lot to come from you try and really get everyone riled up ready happy and looking to score for us and on there and we'll get into the game uh what have they got here do you feel your ambitions are going to I absolutely have no doubt i know i can rely on him you've uh, he's just being rested and let's see how we get on obviously there's not really much i can say about Bayern. no one really knows i mean they're a fantastic team got fantastic players uh, every player in every position is pretty much a world-class player but Castro tips trips for regress. Oh, that was going to be something then, like a yellow card or a red card. Um, yeah, they've got, they've got so many good players. They buy in Munich. Obviously, easily probably the best team in Germany. Have been known for ages as the best team in Germany. So this is the team we're trying to beat. Which we're trying to, you know, knock off the top perch. So hopefully we can do something here, as. Hummels now has got the ball and they're passing it around quite well. But we are 
not doing too bad. Learn down to keep the ball. It gets it out to common. Common with a shot, but it's a bit of a tight angle. And it stays nil-nil. If we can just get Stank out of this, it would be absolutely great. Now, oh, I thought that was us maybe getting a chance for a break there. Muller with the ball now. Gives it to Vidal. Gives it to Common. But it's a bit of a bad pass. And Barch collects it. So there's to Yamalenko. Yamalenko now. Oh, I thought I was going to go in or something then. Ah, oh. and it's all a bit tight, really. And as you expect, they are having more shots. We're on counter. We're uh, we're not looking to try and push too far forward because they're going to just they'll punish us if we get too far forward. So I think we need to do a more direct approach. Apparently, when it's the tactics. Do a bit more direct passing. See if that does anything for us. As we go back to the pitch. And burn the changes. There we go. But we do look like we're in a bit of a fitter state than these guys. So hopefully that might be something that comes about later on. But they are having lots of shots. at them. They've had 12 shots already. That is the first half. I mean, I'll be happy with a draw here. Uh... We're not really having the chances. That's the main problem, isn't it? I say we say assertively. I'm lucky. Uh, I'm pleased to have to keep it up. People look reasonably happy. Tactics-wise, <coughs> excuse me. I couldn't help that. I need to sneeze. Tactics-wise, we do. Can we do anything that will change things around a little bit? Um. Hey, dribble less. We're going to try and pass it around a little bit more. We're going to use tighter marking. Um, that's that. We're going to try and play it out a bit more wider. Just to see if that will do anything for us. For a second off. We've made a few little changes. Hopefully they might just make a little bit of a difference. We've got great passing, so we can try and use that. Try and use our fitness as well. I mean, they are over us, aren't they? Common now comes forward, but we do tackle brilliantly. We get to Castro. Castro gets it forward to Abanyang, but he's absolutely surrounded by so many people. But he looks like he's been given a foul. Vidal there. What's going to happen to him? Is it a yellow or a red? It's a red card. They're down to 10 men. We've got to now change it. We've got to go to standard. We've got to go off the counter. We've got an extra man. See if we can get Sank out of this. Gonna make a substitution. We're gonna bring on Shinge. Um and we are going to bring on Pulsic on the right. And let's just see if we can get Sank out of this. We've got an extra man now. This is where we really do need to try and make that count. As we get calgar has got it, and unfortunately we just don't get it now. Landowski's got the ball. But can we tackle him? We do. And Castro now collects it, gives it back to Shinge. We let the ball slip again. And with 20 minutes to go, we are a man up. We really do need to try and take advantage of this. But Lewandowski now with the ball. And they are starting to come forward. And Koeman's got the ball now out on the wide. And it's been a free kick. And hopefully this is not another yellow card. This is going to probably put us down to 10 men as well. If that is the case. We'll need to go back to the counter. And he has been sent off as well. That's an absolute disaster for us. What can we do? We're going to change to a 4-4-4-2-3-1. But what we're going to do is instead we're going to go for a 4 2 and Bring everyone back a little bit. Try and keep things going okay. Uh, who can we bring on here? We're going to have to play Bartra out there, aren't we? We're going to have to play Bartra there. And bring on Topak in the middle. Topak coming in the middle. There you go. There we go. Change him to a central defender. It's not ideal, but I think this is what the only thing we can do. And look to play for the draw. We're going to carry on playing. We've made a few little changes. Hopefully, this will just be able to see out the last 10 minutes. Ribery's came on. Absolutely brilliant player. And it's not looking good. I don't think we're going to get a winner. But we might do here. As... 
We've got the ball. Can we do anything with it though? Guerrero to Socrates. Socrates to Castro. Castro puts it out to Sherla. Sherla's got the ball. Can he do anything with it though? Back to Castro. Gives it back to Calgar. To Yamyanga. Abamyang gives it to Bartra. Who gives it to Polsic? Polsic now with a chance. Can he get a cross in? He knocks it back to Calgar. Going on Castro. Guerrero's. Get in there. Yes. Get in there. 1 0. Guerrero, Guerrero got the goal. 1 0 to us. Get in there. Fantastic. That means so much. Castro with a great little pass there. And I mean, I thought it was just going to be a highlight that it was going to fizzle out. And I was getting a bit sort of ribbery now with a bit, but we do clear it. There's a couple of minutes left to go. And we've got to be so careful. The goal is coming up. Nerd's coming up. They're trying to get it. Can we get this out? We do. But they're coming forward again. Lewandowski with the ball, but no, we collect it. And with 40 seconds left to go, can we hold off? We pump the ball up. Unfortunately, we don't really do anything. And they're going to come forward again. They are pushing forward as hard as, as possible. And they take a shot, but it goes wide. There's four minutes of extra time to be played. All we can do now is go defensive. See if we can pass it with the ball. He tries to cross it in, but unfortunately we can't. And they pump it forward. They're trying to look for an equaliser here. That's going to go out. And hopefully that should be time. Come on, that's four minutes. We've literally got a few seconds. And there we go. We beat Bayern 1-0. Second time we've beaten this season. Absolutely fantastic. They were the better side. Players sent off either way. God, that game had everything. And we come out victorious. Team talk, I mean, what more can I say apart from passionately? But what a great result. Um, can I talk? Select a player. Select players. I want to talk to Prisrick. Say, assertively, I'm disappointed you're getting sent off. Looks to switch off. But you shouldn't be getting sent off. Oh, I can't believe we beat them. That's fantastic. That's That just... Helps us out so much. Oh, that's fantastic. 1-0. As you can see it, we're only two points behind Bayern now. Red Bull won as well. So, it's all really close at the top. Preswick's been banned for one game. We're going to issue him a warning. Getting sent off. He does accept it. Uh, I will do all this and we will get through to the Stuttgart game next. So, I will see you guys in a flash right guys welcome back after the flash we've got um we'll put horn in there as well actually. so we've got a uh, few changes in the team just for, to freshen it up our players are a little bit tired so we're going to bring horn back into goal uh schmeisel's going to come out on the left hand side it's going to be socrates popak and then tojan's coming in obviously because of the suspension to Prizek. Uh, in the centre we're going to have uh, Sahin and Dahoud. And then we're going to have Polsic on the left. He's going to take over from Scherler. Give Scherler a rest. Gotthez is going to be in the middle. With Yamalenko is going to be out on the right. And Isaac's going to come up forward and give um, Abamyang uh, a little bit of a rest. I still think it's a good enough side. We, can, we should win. There should be no problem against Stuttgart. We'll see how we get on though. As after the fantastic win we just had against Bayern Munich, you'd have to say that this should carry on. We're going to do the usual talks, have faith in you, make sure everyone's happy, make sure that they're all morale-wise doing as good as possible. Uh, we'll set the auto instructions and we'll get it off. And the future of it with Pundits. What to say here? I hope they stick with him. I guess that's the best thing to say. Say there. So we'll get into the game straight away. Uh, Stuttgart not doing too bad. I think they're about 14, 15 for the moment. Um, 
you know, they uh, only just came up this season after being relegated, uh, then coming back up last season straight away. But they're funny old side Stuttgart. You know, a couple of years ago, they were a great German side, doing quite well in Europe and stuff like that. They fell off a little bit over the last sort of maybe five or six years, but not a bad side at all, really. Uh, so they've got to be careful. But we get a chance. It might as well. It gets, it gets the ball into Polsic. Polsic's got a chance here for a cross. He gives it to Isaac. Isaac gives it to Yemelenko. Yemelenko was shot and it hits the bar. And Pavet gets it out. But we get another chance here. And Sahin's going to collect this here. Gives it out to Schmeisel. Schmeisel gives it to Sahin. He gives it to Polsic. Polsic's got a little bit of a chance here. He gives it to Darud. Darud gives it to Gutez. Sahin. We're passing it around lovely. There to go to Yamalenko. Gets it into Isaac. Isaac with a shot. But it's a bit of a wide one. And as much as I feel we're in control. We just need to get that goal first we get a chance here but unfortunately it doesn't come to anything but a deflection then it maybe gives a chance to get a shot off and it just goes wide as the ball gets lobbed up front but we collect it here but then it took guard to have it now they are passing it around it looks like they're going to get maybe a little bit of a chance but we're closing them down well can we get the ball back? As Genta's got the ball. And they've oh, great interception by Tol Toljan there. And he gets Isaac free. Isaac's got a couple of players around him, but he comes forward and he takes a shot and unfortunately it goes wide. We mean with the better side, we just haven't scored yet. As they pump it up forward, but we should hopefully get this. Isaac then gets it, gets it down to Polsic. Polsic now with the ball. Isaac's got the ball again. He's a bit free. Can he get out wide? He tries to, but it's a bit of a wayward pass. And Toljan collects it. Socrates now has the ball. We're passing it around to the left. Polsic's now with the ball. Can he release Schneisel? He does. Put it back into the middle to Gotez. To Polsic. Polsic with the shot. Polsic with the goal. 1 0 to us. Fantastic. Absolutely brilliant. And we're in the lead. Get in there. Great little bit of passing and it was an easy goal for him. Great time to score just before half time. Hopefully it'll calm things down a little bit. We can crack on maybe get one or two more. We're one nil up and it's going to be half time any second now. There we go. And what can we say apart from calmly, things are going well. Now you're capable of even better, which seems to have gone down pretty well for us. Fitness wise, everyone's looking reasonably fit. A uh, couple of 70s, but nothing to worry about. And we're looking like we're okay on the rating so far. So we're not going to make any changes. We'll get straight into the second half. Hopefully, we can score another goal and see the game out as 15 minutes in schmeisel has been injured on the left hand side which is a little bit of an issue We've got Guerrero we can bring on there though which is fine it's a bit of a shame he's been injured though any other changes that we possibly would want to make at this second I'm gonna bring go there I'm gonna bring Kawaga on into the middle there and hopefully we can get a goal I mean, it was like to like changes. It was as much as I don't like to see an injury, it's not too bad at the moment. But still, guys have the ball and they're coming forward, but we get a tackle into them. Isaac's now got the ball. Gets out to Polsic. Polsic's out on the wing. Can he do anything with it? Gets tackled, unfortunately. And Stuttgart might have a chance here to get forward. We sort out that though. Dahoud's now got the ball. Gets it to Kalgar. Kalgar gets out to Yemelenko out wide. Put it back into the middle. Isaac's now got a chance. He's free. He gets it. 2 0. Get in there. You beauty. Hopefully, that should give us the comfortable lead now. And it's been a good game by us. Yarolenko with a fantastic pass there to show him. Same with a great ball to Isaac. Isaac then just uses a burst of speed, puts it into the net. Thank you very much.
Uh, looking a bit complacent, which is a bit of a worry. I don't like seeing complacency. Uh, is there a shouting we can say? Concentrate, maybe? We can say concentrate. Hopefully that might do something for us. Probably make a substitution quite soon. As they try to bring it forward, but we can hold out. Calgar's got the ball now. Gives it to Isaac. Isaac with the ball. Calgar tries to collect it, but unfortunately they do tackle us. But I think we're just too much for them. Soldier's going to collect that. And he's got plenty of time here to bring the ball forward. I'm not sure why it's a highlight at the moment. The Sahin's got the ball, but he's terrible passing. But Isaac now collects it. And is this going to lead to anything? Pulse it, gives it to Calgar. Calgar now, can he do anything with it? He takes a shot, but it's a bit of a weak one, really. And that was it. We're going to make one more substitution. We're going to take Sahin off. We're going to bring Castro on. Uh, pretty much a like for like. Should just hopefully give us a little bit in the midfield so we can stop some of these passes. Dahoud gets it. Yamalenko's now got it. Gives it back to Toljan. Toljan to Dahoud. Dahoud takes it back to Topak. Topak to Sahin. Gives it out wide. Guerrero gives it to Pulsic. Pulsic now gives it to Kalgar. Kalgar talks it out wide to Gurin again. Pulsic again. Got a chance to get across, and he does. Yamalenko, Yamalenko with a goal, three 0 Get in there, Yamalenko, who's been scoring for fun season so far, with another goal. And what can we say? A nice, comfortable three 0 win for us, with ten minutes left to go. That was just the. Uh, Substitution for some strange reason coming up. With well, one minute left to go, four minutes added on time. You've got to say, we've won this, it should be all over. Yamalenko with the ball, we do get tackled, but Yamalenko collects it. Toljan now gets the ball, he crosses it into Isaac, he knocks it down to Castro, and that's a bit of a wayward shot by Castro, and I think that's time. 3 0, what a win! Fantastic for us. Team talk wise, what can I say? I'm very happy with the role and the way you played. Everyone looks happy. Everything seems to have gone well. How did the other teams get on? Let's see how long Schmeisel's out for. Two months, that's not good. Um, fortunately, but it is what it is. I'll, I'll do the team talk. I'll do the press conference in a minute. Hold it on. We will praise him in a minute as well. We'll have a quick look at the competition. We are top. Bayern have got a game though to play. I'm not sure who they're playing. Um, find out who they're playing. Who's Bayern got next then? Where is it? Care about this. Bayern have got Augsburg. Who are? I mean, Bayern should win that. I mean, Augsburg haven't really won any games before. Well, they've won two games this season. So I would imagine we are going to end up in second place. But we are now got two points clear of Red Bull, which is fantastic. When are we going to come back? We are going to come back for... We're going to come back for the Frankfurt game. And we'll only play one game that the next episode. But we'll also talk a little bit about who we're going to look to sign. Where we feel we could strengthen to help us kick on for the second half of the season. Um, so it'll probably take up a little bit of time talking about that as well. Please drop a like, please come and subscribe, please come and say hello to me on Twitter as well. It'd be great to have some comments to hear from you guys what you think about Dave. I'd absolutely love, love to hear from you all. As always, it's been an absolute pleasure and I will see you on the next episode. Bye for now.